How's it going guys? My name's John McLennan and I'm here with BluesGuitar.com bringing you this video lesson. <clears throat> and today we're looking at a blues in the key of E. And this is uh, based off of you know, Stevie Ray Vaughan's Lenny as I was just playing there. Uh, and that tune is just, I mean it just blows my mind how amazing the guitar tone is and every single lick. Uh, it's just a, a masterpiece for me. So. Uh, I want to show you the first uh, two opening chords, and the interesting thing about this is that the chord shapes that Stevie's playing aren't your typical blues chord progression chords, but it is a blues. And uh, so here we go. The first chord I play is an E major 13. It starts on the 7th fret with your 2nd finger, and that's on the 6th string. And then I go up to the 4th uh, string, 6th fret. And then the uh, third string, eighth fret. And then on the next two strings, my pinky is going to lay flat and get the ninth fret on the second and first strings. A little whammy bar action. <coughs> so that's the first chord, E major 13, and, and that's really a jazz chord, you know, it's a, it's a lush jazz voicing. And uh, now one thing to note, when I'm playing the context of the tune, when I have that open E ringing, I'll bring my second finger down and play the E note instead of playing the note on the sixth string. So yeah, it just, in the context of the tune, that part's ringing. But when you start out the tune, you get this real lush chord that's actually rootless. There's no E in this chord. Then of course the bass player comes in and you know, plays that note, so we're just kind of staying out of his way and playing the extensions. The next chord is going to be an E major 6, and this goes up to the 12th fret here with my 2nd finger, and then the 11th fret on the 4th string, uh, 13th fret on the 3rd string, and 12th fret on the 2nd string. And then the tricky part about this is you want to arc your fingers over so that you dampen all the other strings and you get no open strings. Just real chimey sounding chord. Notice I'm also uh, not in the neck pickup, but I'm just one click back on my Strat. That gets kind of a real glassy tone. So the first two chords together sound like this. Then you can play open E in the harmonics. 12th fret. The way you do a harmonic is you just hold your first finger right over the frets. You don't push down like, like you're going to fret the note, but you just touch it, touch the string, come into contact with it, and then you should be able to actually remove your hand and the notes keep going. And then of course he gets into his, you know, Hendrixy double stop, Curtis Mayfield, Steve Cropper kind of, kind of playing. You know, and, and that stuff is just uh, so soulful, you know. So then the other section that, you know, I played there was the B section. And all that really is is that same E6 chord, but he moves it around. And just kind of arpeggiating the chord. Check it out, Lenny by Stevie Ray Vaughan, and be sure to click the link below for the tabs. And uh, we'll catch you in the next lesson. I'm John McLennan. Thanks for watching.